originally the museum started almost as a memorial to country doctors, but it's changed over time. When ECU acquired the museum, um, we changed the mission a little bit, and now it's to interpret history in rural America, especially North Carolina. Um, and so I think we tell a story of American health care and the innovations that have happened in medicine. We have a very uh, um, extensive collection, over 5,000 pieces on site, and uh, the, the tour is a very personal experience in that uh, it is an hour guided tour and we invite uh, visitors to ask questions and it, it pre um, presents an interpretive uh, thematic approach to, to the museum site which gives a, a visitors a real uh, tapestry of, a, of the, the story of what we do here and kind of enlightens the whole 19th century, early 20th century medicine so they could uh, come back with a, a rich understanding as opposed to just accumulation of random facts. The doctor-patient relationship was something uh, very special. It was um, uh, very personal in nature. You knew your doctor almost for a, a lifetime, for, you know, for better or for worse, and most of those times it was better. Um, they would be able to maybe deliver you into the world to kind of seeing you through the end of it. Uh, but it was a real, uh, you, they might practice for 60 some years, and some of them actually practiced and saw patients when they were 90 years old. So if you take it the ledgers, it's really kind of um, looking back into the history and seeing that they really did for their fellow man. It was a real humanitarian spirit. Uh, the good old times weren't always so good, um, and also just in terms of the evolution of medicine, it's, it's easy to kind of look back and kind of, you know, to joke and say, you know, what, what were they doing back then, but I always caution kind of folks to say that, you know, if somebody looks back 50 years from now, they're saying, you know, what were the savages using in 2009 in terms of medical treatment and how far we've come and kind of where we're going. Well, Bailey, it's just the perfect spot, really. It's a small uh, rural town. Um, people comment that it just, it fits in Bailey, um, and certainly it does. Um, Bailey's had a, a history of country doctors, and the surrounding communities have had a really strong tradition of country doctors. Um, and it really just represents small town America in a, in, a, in a little snapshot. So it's a nice place to get off the road, come and visit for a little while, um, and learn about our history, everyone's history.